all right wonderful people lovers of freedom good morning good afternoon good evening to each and every one of you welcome back to let's talk tv your one and only youtube platform where they give a back-to-back -back update on how things they be on how things they share for biafra land and beyond if you're joining us for the first time remember to subscribe and turn on your notifications too also remember to like and share this broadcast too okay my people i see the hot weather now so we go they give and right to straight to now i say yes my people nigerian passport has been ranked number eight world's most useless <laughs> uh, yes my nigerian passport is in the top 10 most useless passports ever made at the moment yes my people that is what we are getting straight from because it is on every uh, uh, uh media at the moment yes my people it is everywhere this is the extent that the uh, nigerian uh, disintegration and nigerian end has actually reached my people you don't enter this kind one way nigerian passport don't enter top 10 most useless make it just they let you know say this country you know get as it be where this country won't survive anything again yes my people because this country don't go as they be now nothing can save this country from being from going down the drain and that is the truth of the matter because at this point everything we are getting is just the negative concerning this country nigeria nothing is showing positive impact nothing is showing positivity at all concerning the movement of this country and uh, that is it uh, even as i uh, talking to you now uh, we are going to go into the details of this news as uh, it will be okay uh, the latest one as the hotel where they come straight uh, they tell us say nigerian passport has been ranked among the worst on the globe <laughs> highlighting significant challenges for nigerian travelers exactly the latest assessment by visa guides world passport index ranked nigerian passport as 191 out of 199 countries above 199 countries above countries like north korea iraq libya sudan pakistan uh, afghanistan syria and somalia these are the countries that are worse than us so my people, if these are the countries that are worse than us, it means that the rest of the countries are better than us. The ranking will raise concerns about the West African countries' recent efforts to improve mobility, including e-visa initiatives. Nothing you cannot even travel safely if they if you are traveling and they, you they carry Nigerian passport. <laughs> it means say you know the people go they look you, they think say you self no be better person because at the point the rate the the the, the point we are now is the point of where nigeria if they are looking at nigeria they are looking at bad name corruption corruption in high places yes now waiting ego they bring once you just they walk around they carry nigerian passport all around now why <laughs> as they be now we they tell you now say make we they push for our biafra passport if we they move and you tell person say ah i am not from nigeria i am for biafra they will be like hey they never hear of biafra before it is the best thing for us you get one joke when person been tell why uh, yeah, say hey uh, another person they've been they talk so bad about nigeria for the airplane them they play no they come ask them where are you from they come they ask them where are you from you come they talk they come ask them where are you from you know say as they don't talk back about nigeria so they you know get them out where you go you tell them say i am from um i am from nigeria now biafra he talk say i am from biafra they come they ask them ah where is which country is Biafra? He say yeah, that there is a country like Biafra. That that's where he's from. My people, it don't reach the extent. It don't de global. It is now global. You should come to understand that for something like this to be this global, the country has gone to the drain. It is on the biggest decline ever. And as it is right now, there is no saving. There is no saving of Nigeria. It is just a dumb country. If you're, if you're being very sincere, Nigeria is a finished country. You don't be for Nigeria because how will it be ranked? It means say even Ghana, them, the rest of these people, their passports, better pass, Cameroon, Burkina Faso, Egypt, Italy, Hani Lecha. It means say their country, their, their passport, better pass Nigeria. And they, they wake up, they call themselves the giants of Africa. <laughs> giants of Africa, we know, we, we they know the rates. Look, see, look at the country that they are, they, are, they are ranking above them. Just look at the country they are ranking above them. <laughs> and let me continue as he says. Sorry, my people. He says that the, meanwhile, the Singaporean passport came first on the chart as the strongest in the world. Look at Singapore. As the strongest in the world, followed by the Italian, Spaniards, 
France, French, and the German passports. The report added that the factors that contributed to this decline include visa-free access, diplomatic relations, and security concerns. Of course, Nigeria is not a country that has security. And uh, once they are calling security, Nigeria is on the low. It's the lowest. It's the, in fact, they are under the ground when you talk about uh, the security. So you cannot uh, go, they cannot even go forward at all. Other factors are visa-free travel, electronic travel authorization, visa on arrival, electronic visa, e-visa, embassy and other government approved visas, passport-free travel and banned entry. Additionally, the Henley Passport Index considers, considers the number of countries passport holders can enter without a visa. Previously listed the Nigerian passport as among the worst 10 performing travel documents worldwide and it is done like it is done that is the truth of the matter my people believe it or not biafra is the way forward and we need to put in effort to actually do the needful so that we can succeed in anything we are putting our hands into at all as a soldier as a bla member anything you were supposed to do and you end up turning into a sabo it you hit back at you. A way he could that will stop this particular thing because a saboteur will always remain a sabo. You cannot stop being one, and that is the truth of the matter. This particular man you represented, just like he said in his long notes, they are called upon and you restarted representing, and then uh, this thing, this particular beginning that he, he even talked about in his uh, 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 confession or in his uh, begging for forgiveness was that, uh, first of all, he has been silent throughout this thing. You know that his silence means that uh, you don't actually hit her. That is what it means. Because it has gotten to him to the extent that we, we ourselves have now recognized this man, this man's faults and everything he has said. And we know that the uh, PM was among the main people that came out and said, Do you see this particular age of woman? This particular man has done this. This particular man has done this. And brought out everything he, 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 he had gone against. My people, it's not everybody ca that can stay in this fight. And that is the truth of the matter. This fight is not for everybody. And that is the truth. If you know that you are not capable of standing firm where you are, the propaganda and everything they will use and come against you, this government, they are ready to put everything against you. And it might not be your intention, or my people. If it not be your intention, but the kind of oppression where you don't get will change your, your mindset and will make you want to do the opposite. And that is the truth of the matter. And by the time you have changed and you have done wrong, we will not forgive you because what you are supposed to do, you did not do it. And that is the truth of the matter. And I, you see this particular man, a, a Jofo, that was supposed to represent and do the needful. Instead, the man, a guy named or he, he Basaraya, just connived with the IPOP DOS and the federal government and did whatever they could, they, they, they knew how to do, and then left it. And they thinking, thinking that it would be something that would end up to be fruitful for them. Now, maybe they have decided not to give him money or his money has not entered. Or they have uh, 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 what abandoned him. They have left him behind. Something has, must have happened that has made him maybe come back to his senses that, to realize that, oh, I, I have actually done wrong or this thing I did does not make sense. And that is the truth. These people will always end up finding out that they messed up. And by that time, all the are too late. This man is a cancelled man. There is nothing that will make us look at this man and think we trust with him again. Because he has messed up during the time that he was given. And that is the thing about this fight. My people, the amount of things they have thrown at people, they have thrown at every single person that looks like or that is thinking like the person wants to like support the movement immediately immediately they have thrown a lot of arguments they've thrown a lot of a lot of backfiring on the person just to make sure that this person does not uh, does not succeed or does not continue on that particular thing the person has decided to do you see and that is what these people have been doing from the beginning of time from the beginning of time and i believe that is what they used to convert the ipop people to themselves, the IPOP and the IPOP DOS, as they've 
turned around to start messing up together with the Southeast governors that have been messing up. Every single one of them, make I know general, but most of them have been, have been, have messed up to the core and cannot even be called people that are trustworthy. And that is the truth of the matter. That is the fair truth of the matter. Because when we cannot have people that are even trustworthy, when we cannot have our leaders that are trustworthy or politicians that can, in their own part, be steadfast and do the things, stand firm in some kind of things that will, that will strengthen this fight, then we cannot move on. And that is the truth. We cannot move on. We cannot, we cannot, we cannot actually have hope that ah, this particular person is siding us and pull through this person. But of course, that is what we have. That is, that is, the, the, the unity is what we lack, but it is not going to stop us. We would use what we have to get what we want. And until we get what we want, we are not backing down. And so, yes, my people, this is it. This is what we have for this particular broadcast. This is where we come to the end of this particular broadcast. Thank you for joining us. Remember to subscribe and turn on your notifications too. Thank you.